Cycle Tracks is an idea where we compose unique music from Cycling Performance Deo. It was great collaborating with Amplifon. Their products and services always push the boundaries of audio tech and we wanted this piece to do the same. We've made a site that allows people to turn their Strava rides into music. Once you've authenticated the Cycle Tracks application with your Strava account, you'll be able to select from a list of all your rides. The data from the ride you select will be used to generate music dynamically. Data from Strava it contains information about distance travelled, speeds, altitudes and the gradient at any given point. All those parameters are used to control how the music sounds. So long rides result in longer music, fast rides result in faster music and rides at higher altitudes they have higher pitches. One of the musical inspirations for this piece was Kraftwerk, especially the Tour de France album. We're using the oscillators and the web audio API in much the same way as early electronic music pioneers would use analog synths. We create certain elements uh, within the music to reflect your ride experience. So a kick drum is used like a heartbeat. Uh, then there's breathing sounds which speed up and slow down in time with your velocity. Long synth notes rise and fall to reflect your altitude data and then wind sounds increase as your velocity increases. Each piece of music is built around a, like, a constant looping musical pattern and this mimics the repetitive motion of your bicycle wheel going round. We use some recorded sounds but most of the audio is generated mathematically using oscillators and, that are available as part of the Web Audio API. These raw oscillator sounds can be manipulated with filters, envelopes and effects and the settings for all those manipulations are derived from the personal cycle ride data, making uh, your music really unique. Adding atmosphere and real-world sounds like freewheeling and breathing adds new dimension to the track. Although it is possible to listen to a ride for the full duration, we create an interface which lets you squash or compress the data so that you can share your generated music in smaller chunks. So for example, a three-hour ride could be played in 40 seconds. So you can share just the key parts of your ride, like that mammoth climb or that speedy descent. To go with the music, we created visuals that also reflect the data. Some of your data maps really well to visuals rather than audio. Within a WebGL 3D space, people can travel around an abstract landscape, recreating movement and direction of the ride selected. This transformed a typical 2D view into a 3D style roller coaster experience. With the rise of indoor and plus smart trainers and the likes of Zwift, we're really excited about the possibility of generating music in real time whilst you ride. Our aim is to give people the kickstart they need in the new year, encouraging them to get out on the bike, record their data on Strava, and then bring it to life with cycle tracks.